right guys it's Bobby Organics and we are back um, the rain is hideous today well not hideous but it's not very nice it's my only free day again um, so I need to get planting on these potatoes um, these are my Dutchy organic ones from Waitrose uh, they've cheated I'm gonna plant uh, three pots with three in each and I bought some seeded potatoes from the store and I'm also gonna chuck a load of those in and these gingers um, so I'm going to go outside guys, I'm going to start filling up some pots with some compost and I will get back to you. Uh, I don't really want to be taking the camera out in the rain. Um, I have got a little tripod and a cover for it but still uh, it's brand new and it cost me a lot of money so I'm just going to hold it off for a minute but I'll be back soon once I've got these planted in and I'll give you a quick update so peace guys. Alright guys it's Bobby Organic so we're back and as you can see I'm out in the rain at the moment. Um, don't want to be out here too long. Um, I'm just going to pop, uh, I've popped four of the Dutch organic potatoes in this barrel here. This is a huge container along with this one, uh, probably 50, 60 litres at least. Um, I'm just going to cover them with a bit of compost, uh, probably to about here, pop the label in and I'm going to put them outside and put a little, uh, a little uh, cover over them if I can find one indoors. Uh, so that's just a quick update on these potatoes. I'm going to do the seed potatoes afterwards and I will uh, follow up with a progress report. So I'll be back in a second, guys. Okay, guys, as you can see, I've covered those up. Um, I've just covered them with a thin layer on top. Um, and that's that. So I've just done those two rows there. And I'm just going to pop these labels in. As last year, guys, I pulled them out way too early. Had no idea when I planted. Um, I'll layer these up as we go along. And I'm just going to move these into the garden, pop them in one of the new beds, and uh, lay a sheet over them just to keep the frost off. So I'll give you another update in a bit, guys. All right, guys, it's Bobby Organics. Um, so I, um, I've done the Dutchy organic potatoes. I'm not doing the other ones until tomorrow. I'm absolutely soaked. I've even got a top one, look. Uh, it's unusual for me. Um, so I've just, this is my first time growing ginger. This is my fresh ginger. I've got a shop bought one as well, but I'm not doing any more pots. As I said, I'm soaked. Um, I've just placed that on the top. I'm gonna cover it and see what happens, guys. Um, I'm gonna put it in the, the uh, bed with the potatoes and just, if we get any frost, I can cover it up. Um, and that's gonna be that. So I'm just gonna place some soil over the top of that, pop a label in it, it, and I'll be back in a week or so with another update. Anyways, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe and peace. Okay, guys, the uh, potatoes and the ginger has been planted. I'm going to go down to Wilco in a bit, try and get some of this frost protector. I'm going to fill in the outside and pop one over the top. That should keep it warm enough uh, for that. And one last thing, guys, I'm just going to go down. Um, I've got a few of these red onion sets, and I'm going to pop them in the ground down there. Uh, I'm just going to grab a nice... I'll take the bag with me actually and we're just going to pop a few of those in the ground next to the spring onions now I don't know if I did an update of this yet guys but I pretty much filled out the beds they're looking really nice really well fertilized uh, I still need to do this one and I've pretty much leveled out the back over there um, so over here what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try my luck here and I'm probably going to plant a few of these in the ground. So uh, I'm going to do them four inches apart. Uh, so we're going to get three rows there. Pop them in the ground and fill them up. <laughs> I probably should do the rows first. In fact, I'm just going to pop these in the ground. I'm going to pause the camera quickly and I'm going to do a load of rows, guys. Two secs. Okay, guys, I've popped a load of holes in the ground. They're about four inches apart. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pop me onions in, uh, root side down, obviously, and fill them over. Uh, the package says February. I've never done them from seed sets before. Actually, I've never even grown onions before. Uh, so we'll see what happens, guys. I'm just going to pop all of those in and cover that up and pop a label in the ground and that's pretty much that for today guys um, if there's anything I'm missing with these onions drop a comment in the comment box um, really trying to uh, grow more things this year which I haven't grown before obviously I've done 
pretty much most vegetables um, but it'll be interesting to see if we can uh, grow the rest of them guys uh, asparagus is another one I want to do paying a lot for that at the moment um, but anyways guys I'm just gonna fill this in I don't want to bore you guys and I'll do an update if I see any sprouting anyways guys peace don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and uh, happy gardening guys peace